such a single feather. There we go. Well, bother. How dare you! You betrayed us! I will not be cast about them! Come, bring us! I'm long as you want me. Explain the honors. What have you done? I murdered the poor slob. Come back here. Let me know. You've heard quite. I have so much. Slip up. You want me to address you? Bye bye. Shit. Not so fast. Wait, it almost seems come as back. Wants me to follow it. I need to find it before the poachers do. Nobody will be able to do it. I sense it. Lippery is a kelpie, they say you are. <laughs> Take that bad guy from, uh, what's him? Oh, Tuck Everlasting. <laughs> That's right. The man in the yellow suit. <laughs> well, I've stolen far more than that, my dear. Oh, damn. You know, I could use a friend here. Oh, no, not him. <laughs> Oh shit! Is this your best? Um, I need a bombarder there. It's Burn you! Woo! You need to die. Whatever it costs. That was the highway. Your poaching days are over. Your breathing days are over also. We're back outside. Hello. I'm here to help. I can take you somewhere safe. Oh, it's not no fight. Look at that. Let's get you back to the room. Deke's going to be pleased. He's going to be delighted. Just delighted. Do it again, you shithead. I'm ready for this time. Oh dear. Did you find the phoenix? Yes, Deke. I did I better than that. The poachers. I have it here. It's safe. Remarkable. Well, what are you waiting for? Deke cannot wait to... I'm sure you can't. Oh my. My heavens. More barbarians? What a beauty. You keep it close. Why are my cuffs see-through? Now, well, who are you? Hello, sir. Might you have some time to talk? I have all the time in the world for a potential customer. <laughs> How do you do? I'm Cromwell, 
different problem. No, you're Mr. Pippin for Mr. Pippin's potions. <laughs> That's who you are. Not gonna thank me for doing that uh, little errand for Madame Huawing, whatever her name is. Such a pleasure doing business with you. I received your owl. Thank you. I'm glad you came. I spotted droves of Ranrock's loyalists coming up from the coast. Overheard one of them say they're headed to another cavern, like the one we found. How are they still one step ahead of us? They can't know about the triptych. I don't know. Well, no, they, they move in the memory. realm between realms. This time, it was a keeper named Neve Fitzgerald. She was unnerved by Isadora's use of ancient what magic. What the heck happened to my leg there? I still can't be sure how any of it connects to Ranrock. These keepers are playing games with you. You need to press them for more information. It doesn't work like that. To access each of these memories, I have to complete a trial. It's not as easy as you think. They're showing me the memories in a particular order. We're just not getting answers. I need answers. For Anne. I know. Now, shall we see why the triptych led us here? Let's go, quickly. Lumos. Spotted. Yes, spotted in this darkness. Out, I saw some of Ranrock's crew moving off the path just ahead. Ah, but if you don't feel that way, I'm what the? Behind me? Ranrock's loyalists deserve the same fate. Nice work. Don't buy. They saw me through the fence around the corner. <laughs> How do they keep getting behind me? Sebastian, wait. Wait? For what? Uh, why are you suddenly so cautious? Listen why are you me. suddenly so disgusted? I know you're angry and frustrated. But charging ahead now could undo all the progress we've made. Lord Gok said... Oh, your goblin friend. Stop mm -hmm. it. That's enough. Not all goblins are like Ranrock. I am not the enemy. We want the same thing. To find answers. I thought we wanted the same thing. We do. Listen to me. Lord Gok has insights into Ranrock that we don't. He told me that Ranrock somehow knows about the Keepers and is searching anywhere connected to each of them. That's why they always seem to be one step ahead. I know what I'm doing. You need to trust me or I don't see that we can continue together. Fine. Fine. I'm sorry. I'm letting my emotions get the better of me. And I have been for a while. I do trust you. And I don't think I can help Anne without you. Good. Ranrock clearly knows more than we thought. We need to be careful and do this right, not just go charging in. We have our work cut out for us. 
We need to work together if we're going to find the final piece to the triptych. Boy, if only I had a killing curse. Oh, damn. I didn't have time. What? Damn it, I didn't get to do it for Clendo. Nope, damn. Whoa! I want to die. What the? I, mean, I swear, I sometimes my my damn things don't even come out. Damn it! I shouldn't have done that. There we go. like an angry troll to bring friends together back to the undercroft we go tonight another piece on the great tapestry I believe the journey this triptych took us on no no don't say anything out loud ominous might be around and you know how this his is blood it. pressure is don't keep me in suspense go on place it it's funny you're the one actually stalling me A pensive. Another pensive. This is what we've been chasing. The Undercroft is here. What is it? Let's find out. We're both going? They were clear and I had to do this alone. At least for the trials. I Tell me, Tim Roth, what bothers you? <laughs> but I can give you peace. That is Tim Roth. Look at that. <laughs> I took his pain. Thank you. He speaks. He sounds nothing like a male Blotsky. It worked. It did indeed. Of course it did. It's goblin silver. Bragboar. Much bigger. All right. It would help if you could tell me more about what it is you're storing. Magic. Left over from a spell I devised to remove pain, but... If used correctly, its power can be used to do even more good. Why would you want to store such magic away? I only need to keep it safe until I can convince my colleagues of its worth. Magic like this? Unnerves them. Not everyone's ready to wield such power. Perhaps not. But someone will be. Took away the pain. I knew it. I knew there was a way to help Anne. Something isn't right, Sebastian. What do you mean? 
You saw what she did. No, not the memories, the portrait. I, I think the reason Isadora hasn't appeared is because she can't. I don't follow. She was cursed we never to appear in her portraits. The abandoned home in Felgroff, the destroyed painting, it was her. So someone destroyed a bit of enchanted canvas, but we found the memory. Yes, yes, you're right. We saw what she wanted us to see. We saw what she could do, what you can do. But I don't know how to do what Isadora did. Well, then you shall learn. The Keepers can teach you. Oh, dear. I saw that they would. The Keepers believe that removing someone's ability to feel pain... It's a highly complicated, unpredictable form of magic. One that should be wielded with great care. If at all. If at all? You've overcome all of their challenges. You've more than proven yourself. You can wield it. You have the ability. Perhaps. But do I have the morality or lack thereof? Please. Talk to the Keepers. If not for me, then, then for Anne. The choice is mine. Redwalk is it? Oh, you fucker. on Ranrock's hands. Another drill is complete. The wizarding world will promise. <laughs> That's I not exactly an down. army, you know. It's barely even a baseball team. <laughs> oh. Perfect. You're mine for the time being. Oh no, not him! Damn it. Oh shit. You were saying? Bye bye. The in the dreams. How do I get up there? Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Look like a ledge. I have to find a way to stop that drill. Good break up. Destruction is my specialty. You. Me. That is unfortunate. Me, me, no matter, me. We'll build another. I found this one lurking outside. Lord Gok. Well, we got ourselves a tag team match. Brother, I came to stop this. What is this you've brought me? Lord Cock. 
No. It cannot be. All this time, you knew. You knew where it was. <laughs> Never understand you, Lord Gok. So, Gollum, that witch did not consider you an equal. She, like all wizard kind, sought only to use you. You're wrong, Ranrock. The young ones are especially deceitful. They are taught to hide their disgust for us as they exploit us. Astonishing mm. that our ancestors ever trusted each other. All this time, looking everywhere for the final repository. Searching in vain for Bragbore's last journal. Wasted my time chasing a child. And my little brother knew where it was all along. But now I don't need you. I don't need any of you. He's gone steady. Bringing it to you. Right into our kind. No. no! We didn't do anything. <laughs> this music is not matching what's going on here. What is this music choice? tried so hard to reason with him well we're not exactly the hero of this story seeing as though we did absolutely nothing of substance there except for destroy a few pillars now to get out of this blasted place according to the ally received ranrock is moving more quickly than we could have anticipated this is grave news indeed that's only we probably the third time, time you've said that person forward let us hear what the student has to say Adopt Babaloo Bop Bop Bamboo. You received my owl. Ranrock has the last of Bragbore's journals. He killed Lodgok to get it. He knows where the last repository is. Godric's heart. Lodgok. Mm. And because Lodgok Ranrock, Ranrock can't Ranrock aim worth a shit, brothers. he's still alive. Lodgok is bringing the journal to me. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. Well, unfortunately, Lodgar couldn't use his Surely dying breath to it. say it. Ranrock has Bragbor's journals and knows where the final repository is. We obliviated Bragbor. He kept journals? <laughs> Why would he have documented all of this? He didn't know what we were containing. Isadora told Bragbor about the magic when she asked him to build a container for her. I've seen her memories. Isadora left memories for someone to find? You know what she did? She Our left them in the undercroft. Which I also saw in Professor Rookwood's pensive. And the conversation with Bragbor in which she expressed frustration about the limits being placed on her use of ancient magic. Based upon the memories they have seen, I believe our young friend is well aware of the grave circumstances in which we find ourselves. Yes, but a girl named Anne really needs the next some trial help. will involve an exceptional level of magical skill and a nuanced ability to interact with beasts. Wait, is that really Find necessary? Find a face of stone and tendrils. I should advise you that you must engage with any beast that is part of the trial on your own. Meaning Professor what? Professor will meet you in his pensive room. Sebastian has gone too far. You oh. saw what lies in the catacomb. I cannot stay here. Wait, Anne, please. Ominous. He was willing to put the whole hamlet and himself in danger on the chance that some old relic could help to heal me. First of all, the I'm goblin sorry. attack was not his fault. Make sure he's all right, will you? I'm glad you're here. Where the hell are you going? I received your owl. Where's Sebastian? Inside the catacomb. Frankly, I was surprised you weren't with him. Ominous. 
I... Stop. You swore you wouldn't let Sebastian take this one step further. Yet here we are. I actually don't remember saying that. He won't listen to reason. I should have stopped him before. Sebastian's in real trouble now. I'm going back into the catacomb to find him. Anne's right. He and the entire hamlet are in danger. Oh, the place yes. is crawling right. with Inferi. Inferi? What are you talking about? You'll see. We need to hurry. Oh shit. Oh yeah, I can't block that one. Okay, uh, maybe this will do some good. Let's see. Careful there. You have to burn them. <laughs> Why is it attacking him? Hold on a moment. I was so worried about Sebastian, I didn't even realize. Anne's gone to get Solomon. Yeah, that's when what she first saw the Inferi, she thought Sebastian was being attacked. But then he showed her the relic and said he'd learned how to use it. The he was summoning them? Inferi? And Sebastian somehow created them? Not exactly. He's controlling them. This is powerful dark magic. Creating Inferi is incredibly difficult, but controlling them... As Anne and I frantically battled the, the Inferi to keep them from escaping, <laughs> Sebastian kept mumbling about healing Anne. When Anne said she couldn't stay here, I didn't realize what she meant. Solomon threatened to go to the headmaster if he heard of Sebastian dealing with dark magic. I need to get to Hogwarts. I must get to Professor Black first. Twist the story a bit, make him think it's a family fight. I'll be back as soon as I can. See if you can talk some sense into Sebastian. Isn't this incredible? Um, that depends. How is this helping in? Sebastian, I told you, the relic is the answer. I've been trying to reverse the dark magic that injured Anne, but this will allow me to control it. Just as I can control the Inferi. Control? I had to fight the Inferi all the way. What's happening here? What have the two of you done? Accio Relic! You fool! The Relic! Oh dear. You'll pay for this! Um, what is my... What, we're, we're fighting him? Sorry, buddy. Where is he? Ow! Back at your shithead. I never wanted to get involved. You be healed, Sebastian. You must stop. Finish him. I won't let her suffer. Avana Kedavra. What? He... he killed them? Oh dear.
poor Russell Crowe. He's paid the ultimate price. Stay here. I need to find Ominous. Sebastian, please. I'm not myself right now. Clearly. Let's meet later at the Undercroft. All right. Sure, I'll bring the handcuffs. 